honestly, how would I rate the games against CLG? I think me and Link played really bad in this, in this series. No lie. I think we both played pretty bad. Um, probably somewhere around like a 6, 7 of 10. Like, it could have been a lot better. Uh, and obviously those aren't like our, our main strategies going to LCS. Like, we have... We have certain ones that I'm very excited about, but stuff we're probably not going to show until LCS starts. Um, it was it was still a nice set though. Like it, it was good that we know or we found out that we could beat CLG. Like that's the main important thing is that uh, we found out that we could beat CLG, a team that's been uh, remarked on by a lot of our screen partners as being the best team in NA right now, and so that's uh, maybe not as big of a confidence boost as as I would believe, but more of just like a satisfying feeling, you know. Also, when Double F made that tweet, that was hilarious. It was the funniest tweet ever. Uh, and then people, for people who don't know what I'm talking about, hold up, let me accept this. Uh, it is... Wait, this is hilarious. Hold on, hold on. I'm just gonna go back. Ah, uh, this is the best. This this comment string is the best. Ah, uh, this, this is the best comeback I've made this month. It's the best. Now, we're, I don't know if we're the best team in NA, like, certainly I think there needs to be better, better, uh, whatchamacallit, there needs to be more bases than just like one best of three, like I feel like one best of three doesn't prove anything, uh, but it's, it's a nice feeling to win. I think Sidra's fun. So Rocket Support's good because she does a lot of damage. Like she, do, she does a lot of damage, and she gives you like a lot of innate sustain, which is extremely strong if you're a Bruiser diving in. Uh, but pretty much that extra armor pretty much means like you're unkillable by ADs. And there's a lot of team comp stuff like uh, Urgot Taric that's been run a lot that I feel like Soraka would be a better partner with with Urgot in that situation. Dude, Patoy did see 10 times in our last game. Like, literally, we had team fights where he would just be standing still. And they come in six seconds late in the team fight and start, like, doing stuff. And I'm like, Patoy, what happened? He's like, well, Time Warner sucks. And I'm like, okay, well, I can't really say else, anything else outside of that. I think LCS being best of ones is horrible. I don't like it. But <clears throat> the format won't change. So I have to just suck it up and deal with it. Whatever. I think Cat's still good. The next series of nerfs, though, might make it a lot harder. Wukong mid is good. Uh, what should we call it? There seems to be like two different teams in Europe that like love Wukong mid. It's strong, like it's it's good, but like it's much better as like a surprise pick rather than that I'm gonna pick it every single game kind of thing. That I think I saw. Um, who did I see? I saw some random team in the Euro European LCS qualifiers do that, and I was like, uh, I wasn't really happy with that decision. What was that team that played Dragonborn? It was in my, oh my god, yeah, that, that series is horrible to watch. I really did like that series. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to play. I just want to play bottom then. I like the jungle or mid. I guess I'll play AD carry. Was it Millennium? Ooh. Wait, what, what am I doing? Whoops. Don't need that. 
I honestly don't even know if I need this. Like, that seems so unnecessary. Like, when I get crit, it's gonna be really late in the game, so I'm not even gonna bother with that. Could I actually do... I could, but I'd rather go this. I like having the extra 2 armor 2 MR in this. Oh god. Nidu Kate is the most annoying bottom lane. Oh my god. But luckily we're... Are we blue side actually? One, two... No, we're purple side. Oh wow. Oh yeah, this is horrible. Oh, Cesare from my... Yeah, no, I was right. I use Mouse Wheel to, to go through my masteries. And the root page I'm running it now is Armory and Martin, just 15 AD. Oh, uh, taking. Yeah, it is, but I'm playing Ezreal, so the only trades I should be doing are the trades where I will win like 100%. Ari's a good rumor. No, she does stuff that other APs can't. Like the fact that her ulti is such a strong and consistent gap closer that you can get to like certain. You can pull off roams like through wards that wouldn't work with any other champion. Kate Nunu, annoying. I don't play Kazix because he gets. I don't know. Stuff about Kazix, I feel like. He's still really good right now, like, excellent. For some reason, I just never play him much anymore. No, my room is, is of a reasonable size. Carmen search is going well, I just... Uh, kind of well, I don't know. It's cutting it close. We'll, we'll, we'll go with that. What is this by the way? Okay. Let's do it this way. I hate when my, my UI keeps resetting. Why is there so much trash talk in this ELO now? Literally every game I've played in the last couple days, people have just been like trash talking excessively. And typically that doesn't really happen when I play solo queue a lot. This way. Excellent. Unfortunately. In terms of what I can buy, not much. Let's go go with one of these. <coughs> Excellent blitz hit crook uh blitz crank hook though. Like really good stuff. switch aggro to me because I have a lot of pots for this. I want to get a little bit of a lead bottom lane, that's why. And so I'm going to switch aggro back over. Excellent. Excellent stuff. I had to use one of the pots that I used to buy and he has to... hopefully won't have to use any pots. So I come to the bottom lane like pretty equal level with Caitlyn Nunu if they do golems, which I'm almost as... I hate, I hate the fact that he starts uh, Doran's shield on this side too. Yeah, they definitely did golems.
Não é uma pena não, hein? I just have to give up a lot of control. All right, got got the XP for that. That's the big thing. Start auto attacking to push this lane back a little bit. Luckily, Mystic Shot at level one, mana cost is insanely low. All right, we kind of just get pushed back. And this is the nature of, of this of this lane, is that you'll get pretty much pushed on all day. And it's impossible to dive them. Uh, the, the lane that we have is like a little bit workable, I think. Right now we're doing a good job of trying to zone. Oh my god, that killed me. Or, like, that was such a bad play there. Like, oh my god. Like, uh... <coughs> oh, we can't get anything. No, we can't get anything, we can't get anything. But it's fine, it's, no, I mean, it was fine that he went in. I didn't realize that Lee Sin was going to come bottom, straight up. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my, I should have even eat backwards. Oh my god, nope, oh, still died there. Whatever, whatever. I played that a little bit poorly. I didn't think that, that Q would kill me, so I didn't activate my 4 pot, which is really bad. And I just activated it now. Ooh, that's even worse. I don't know why I take risks like that. Wow, this Lee Sin is huge though. 4-0. How's Rise right now? Uh, behind in CS and it's pushing back. That's good. Top lane lost. I think a straight up 1v1. Or actually, I think they split kills. Okay, he's maxing Blood Boil first then. It's good to know. Ouch. Time to strike. Try to push the wave back a little bit before it reaches my turret. I don't want a gigantic wave in my turret. It means we can never fight them if the creep like the, the creep uh wave is too big. They got behind the CS. Oh, he tried to go for it once the creep died, and it did not work out. No problem. This lane is really hard. The fact that I don't main AD makes this lane even harder. Wow, are you kidding me? Uh, that's not good. Whatever. Shen saved him. That was a really, really good hook by Blitz, though. Just want to shove in this lane. Let me try to keep my stacked 5 passive and still last hit these things. Poppy some mana pop. Oh, is he in that bush? No, okay, good. Dang, I don't have a. If I, I wish I had a W to keep my. my uh, my stacks there. That's the only real reason I would get a point into that. That's a dead support. And this is kind of when I back out. Oh, 
Yeah, I'm back. I'm in the back out here. Four pot run runs out now. I have enough lane sustained where it's okay. Like I won't straight fight them unless uh, stuff like that happens where the blitz prank just makes a really, really, really solid play with the hook. Like if I knew I was gonna be lane laning in this lane normally, I probably wouldn't have picked blitz. Like in the in the in the best setting, I would have picked something probably a little bit different. Alright, I hit 6. Once uh, Blitz hits 6, it'll be really, really... I'm actually going to freeze the lane here, I think. Yep. I want the better, the more lane control and safer for us. I just want... How close is he to 6? That's a real question. Stop this back. Alright. I couldn't do that because Blitz was unfortunately just a little bit too far away. Ah, they're pink warding that, okay. This way. I can't even kill him with ulti. Ryze picks up a double. What did he what does she get off that though? He's coming into lane gank here. Maybe I should just get hit with the snowball here. Is there anyone in this bush? No, there's not. Who needs a map? This this is like this is so obvious. That's the problem here is that I think they know it's really obvious too. Time to strike. Yep, it's really obvious. I did not see the animation. Wow, he dodged both of that. Okay. I kind of want to just try ulting from the bush and seeing what happens from there. Hmm. I feel like he's only moving up because. Okay, okay, that's fine. We got the shit ulti. Oh my god. Flash that. Oh, uh, they're just gonna shove this in. I wanted to stay here though. Oh my god. That was horrible, last hitting. I'm gonna back out. Have enough for my BF now? Oh, if she's gonna stay in shove, I will stay in shove. Dang, Shen saves her so much though. Like, she puts herself in really bad positions against Blitz. Like, Blitz is definitely winning like, like a positional war against this champion, but the fact that they have, um, whatchamacallit, Shen makes it really hard for us to win our bottom lane. Oh, we're behind in kills now. I'm gonna go back out now. That was uh Ryze could actually kill him. Yep. He's dead. Let's see if I hit him here. 
I have no idea if that will hit. Dang, I have no idea where you ran out from. Alright, it's fine. He gets that CS. I'm not quite sure why I bought the second long sword. I think it was because I wanted to go Brutalizer, and I realized that item is not what I wanted to get. So I changed my mind. Who needs a map? We really need to push this up and start forcing into other lanes, to be honest. We can cut easily. All right, maybe not. Hook, 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 hook. Oh my god! I thought I thought we could just cut him, to be honest, but oh, what can I do here? Oh my god, please. Please. Ah, uh, I just lost my bot lane because I went mid. Nope, should I stay bot then? I thought we might be able to make something happen, but unfortunately I was wrong, and because of that we lose our bot. <sighs> that's why you, a lot of times you'll see AD carry sit bottom lane, because roaming is something that's... Like the payoff is good, but it's also super risky because now we lost blue control as well as drag control off that. It's not enough for Thurster, but mid just uh mid yeah bot just gonna go mid. All right, they got him. They might even be able to shove this wave in, to be honest. Which is... Actually, I'm just going to go ahead and ulti this. If they're busy shoving in there, I just need to shove in my bot lane. Fortunately, my stacks are about to wear off here. I think Jarvan should be able to get mid in time. Oh. Wow, I did not expect that though. I thought we would just trade a uh, mid for a bot. I think I'm dead. Alright, thank god she didn't, she didn't look for anything there. Have my Thurster, and I want to get. Hmm. Actually, Sheen would be pretty nice right now. No How I build to it though is a little bit silly. Ooh, that's actually a team comp that I need an early an earlier last whisper too. Fourteen seconds. She's gonna back out here. I got the turret, so it's it's okay. Just need to get Thurster stacks. I think. Caitlyn has double buffs right now, so there's no way I can fight her straight up. Uh, straight up, unless I get the jump on her with Blitz. Know your environment. Ooh, is he gonna... <sighs> okay, never mind. Nope. He is not a warning prodigy. He did not get that off. No problem. Yeah, bottom lane shifted mid. That was really smart of, of them, actually. We're coming mid as well. Wow, okay, we did not get any of that. Fortunately, it didn't do us any good. Oh my god. 
kicked her away. It's really not good. I'm dead. Yeah, I can't dodge that last one. Jeez. Oh, that's not good. I should have just flashed over the wall. Like, I don't know why I was trying to avoid a lot that way. I'm just gonna finishing off this um, Frozen Fist, actually. Go straight to finish off Last Whisper, because I really, really, really need it. I realized without boots there, I was 100% gonna die, too. Had I had boots, I might have been able to get away. Maybe? I don't know. Top lane's done as well. Is it? Actually, top lane's winning by quite a bit, yes, but Shen's ulti multiple times. My ulti just does not do that much damage. 600 magic damage. I was expected to do a little bit more. Yeah, Olaf is massive, and the Shen is massive as well. <coughs> Pretty much need to build, build full damage. I'm gonna just stay bottom until I can farm up. Let's go. Unfortunately, I got to the point where I just have to farm. Okay. Got it. Interesting. Wow, I really did. Okay. Cast it a little bit slow. Wow, really didn't get anything? I'm dead. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, uh, they all backed out for the other, the other target? Ooh, he makes it. No, never mind. Nope. Shield? Shield him? Yeah, there's no way he, he can fight. 13, 11, 10. Thing. I played that really crazy. I shouldn't have expected um, Blitz to keep running. He just turned around to help out uh, his backline there, which is like not a bad move. I just expected something different. Know your environment. Should have just played it super safe. Please, can we get this kill? Agreed. I don't even know, but I don't think so. Well. Nope. 16 health. Wow. No time to waste. I'm dead. Yep. Uh Timo lives though? I think. Yeah, he lives. That's Okay, I, I really need boots now. This has been such a bad game. When you have Olaf as well as Arai Shen against and Nunu Kate, like I don't do much damage to anyone there. I should not have bought this mana crystal. Can you just ward it? Wow, he did not go in on that. Surprising, I thought he would. Rise's top lane. Rise is really tanking as armor. I, again, another champion I cannot kill. Just have the ulti, to be honest. If I can feed out the wave a little bit, it's good. Ooh, they're pushing in. Why did... Oh. Uh, okay. No one else went bot. We're just losing turrets now. 
And this is kind of what Ninu Kate does. Like, it's impossible to get to the back line. And they have, like, a really, really good front line, too. We have... Teemo. We have, we, we have Blitz, Jarvan, and Lee, but... I don't know. Not enough of those champions actually do damage. Jarvan actually rushed the last Whisper, though. Like, he act... He might be able to, to carry this game, I'm unsure. Mid's dead. Hit him for 150. Like, we really can't fight this. Please, thank you. Peel that guy off. Oh, why'd he go? Oh, my God. I'm dead. Oh, yeah, that's game. G, 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 G. Suck at AD care. That Teemo. Well, I have my last whisper. I just don't think I could do anything to this team, though. 200 armor. 100 armor all around. GG. Yeah, that Teemo gets so angry every game. Ooh, what the heck? Uh, 